These are the directions for workplace 1A make this sum. The materials you'll need are one deck of cards and a journal as well as a pencil for each player. In this workplace, together players choose a target number between 10 and 15. In our game, we're choosing the number 11. Then each player will write that target number at the top of their page. Prior to starting this game, players will make a 4x4 four four array with the cards face down. Then player 1 will go first. Player 1 will turn over two cards from the 4x4 four four array. I turned over the cards 2 and 3. So the sum of 2 plus 3 is 5. So I'm not quite there. If the sum of the numbers don't add up to the target number, you keep on turning over cards until you reach your target number or as close as possible without going over. So we can get a little bit closer. So let's pick another card. 5 plus 2 is 7. Let's keep going. And right now we have now reached our target number since 2 plus 3 plus 4 equals 11. Since the sum of these numbers equal 11, which is our target number, I will get to keep all four of these cards, as well as write down the equation 2 plus 3 plus 2 plus 4 equals 11. After you have moved cards away from the array, it's important to replace those cards with new cards for the next player. Then player 2 will do the same. If I were to gone over with this sum and it had gone over the number 11, then I would have to turn over the cards and the next player would go. Players will continue playing until all the cards are gone out of the deck. The player with the most cards at the end wins. These are the end of the directions for workplace 1A make the sum. If you like different variations of this game, you can have students have their cards face up rather than face down. They can use a target number lower than 10 or higher than 15, as well as players can choose 15 or 20 as their target number, and then a player turns over four cards at a time and uses a combination of different operations to solve that problem to reach the target number.